Hi everyone, my name is Lorraine Alfiard and I'm a psychic and a spiritual medium. And I wanted to talk a little bit about me, about my own personal journey, growing up, being a medium. And it's my hopes that as I share my story, you get to know me a little bit better and what things have been like for me and hopefully be able to help someone along the way. I am a natural born medium, so that means that I've always been a medium, although I haven't always understood what that meant. Growing up, I've always had that connection with spirit. Uh, from a very young age, I w saw spirit orbs, and I always sensed things. I always was able to feel things, and I always was able to have that sense of knowing, particularly as a young person at night time, when I was saying my prayers, I would have that sense of spirit around me didn't know what that was uh, at the time I, I felt I was feeling God or angels I didn't know what that was but I did know it was something other than just me and I've always been able to be in contact with that I've always been able to hear things when I would give questions or ask things I always received either words or a sense of knowing or a sense of feeling about things and I would also get pictures or images, visions, um, as we call them. And I've always been able to receive those. As a young person, I didn't understand these things. And being around other people, it could be very overwhelming. I was very sensitive to other people's energies. It was just very overwhelming to be around other people at times. And it caused me to really withdraw into myself, into wanting to be quiet, so always wanting space, felt the need to withdraw to my bedroom or outside, and I always had a lot of animals because animals were very comforting to me, and this was my, these were my companions, and I always understood there was a reason for it, and so growing up when I would ask questions and I would get answers, and I was always being told that there was a reason I would understand and that was comforting to me. I was always able to feel the energy of other people and have a sense of knowing about them. And growing up, that just continued. Once I was able to do my own research at the age of 13, I started looking into things more. And there wasn't a lot out at the time. There wasn't a lot of um, information, either books, uh, people didn't talk about this kind of thing. And if you did, was seen as a bit of a freak. Um, I didn't understand the word medium. I just always thought it was psychic ability. And that's what I worked on. It wasn't until many years that did I have the word medium, although I knew that I sent spirit. I knew that I was able to feel it. And I knew that I was able to talk with spirit. Again, I didn't always understand these things, but I knew that there would be... Um, that I would learn the reason why. And I knew that I was always meant to help people, although I didn't always understand what that was going to look like. Uh, so I studied world religion growing up. I studied everything about meditation, everything about healing and energy, and everything about psychic uh, things that I could find. I studied that, everything about the occult and the metaphysical I would research about. And so this has given me a really good foundation for my learning and understanding. I entered into work as a nurse and that further provided me a lot of really good opportunities to be with people, to, to see them, to see their soul journey, and to receive information along the way of what this was about. So I was able to sense their energy, I would sense the, the illness, their chakras, their aura, and I also had the, the real honor of being with people when they passed away and that provided me with being able to sense spirit around them gathering as they were as they were transitioning to the other side and it also allowed me to see how the soul literally pulled up from the physical body to be to, to enter transition into the spirit world, into the astral world. And so I really felt that this was part of my, my learning here on the physical plane for 
to be able to help others. And that's my goal. As I learned more about mediumship, uh, about spirituality and the occult, and what our soul journey is all about, the karma involved and, and past lives, I feel that this is meant to be how I'm meant to help others. And it's my goal to be able to help others understand their own spiritual and soul journey and to be able to help them understand through um, the use of energy work, um, the healing involved, and to be able to help connect with spirit and bring through messages. And that's always been my goal, I feel, that's my life purpose. And that's what I'm seeking to do. There are a lot of people out there that are, are learning now about their own spirituality, that have struggled with being sensitive all their life, that have struggled with these overwhelming feelings. And there's a lot more help out there now than there ever has been before. And again, it's part of what I feel is my life purpose to be able to help others. So um, I do plan on doing a lot more um, video work, a lot more sharing, a lot more um, offering of energy work and this is my goal to be able to help others. So uh, if you like this video, uh, please do give it a thumbs up, please do share and um, please do subscribe to my channel. And I thank you again for watching me. And again, my name is Lorraine Alpier and I'm a psychic and spiritual medium. Thank you for watching and God bless. Bye-bye.